All right, what's up, Amayan? And in this video, I am going to show you Thunderbird. What is Thunderbird? You might ask. This is an email app that allows you to access all the other emails like Google, Gmail, Microsoft Outlook, Yahoo, and other stuff right within it. It can help you ditch multiple apps and web mail. It can. It does have open keychain encryption, which is very nice to have. And it is compatible with Gmail, Outlook, Yahoo Mail, Outcloud and more. Well, this is 100% open source and free to use, which is a great thing for all the apps that I usually feature on my channel. So, Turnbird is free and open source, which means you don't have to pay a single dime for it. Now, today I'm going to show you how you can download it. Simply go to your Google Play Store or the Mac App Store, whichever one you prefer, and download and install it. Once you have installed it, you will be given three options. The first option is import settings. That if you have a Thunderbird on desktop, you can use this. But if you don't have one, which is everyone right there, so you are new to Thunderbird. So add an email account now. Here, just type in your email address. For example, I am going to type in my Gmail address, which is this one, and hit next. This will automatically define the configurations that might be used so here we go now I'm gonna click on sign in with Google this will sign in in Thunderbird this will open up your default browser and if you prefer another browser you can simply click on the share button right there and check another browser for example I'm going with the Samsung internet browser so I'm just gonna click on that one and this will open up Samsung internet browser you might get this settings simply click on next and it might ask you that you have to restart the stuff the process so once you restart it will automatically give you thunderbirds wants to access your email so simply just gonna allow that and wait for it this will automatically scan all the gmails fetch the folders and all of your mail will be there right there so for display options you are gonna need to type in your name or you may not there is a sync frequency which I prefer that I manually sync the Thunderbird I don't have the one auto sync turned on so number of messages you can choose that if you want notifications keep it on this will create an account for Thunderbird and if you want to give it access to your account, uh, accounts you can do that and this is now loading all my mails around 100 of them that are available in my gmail account as you can see don't worry these are not useful emails so the best thing about this is that it can give you a unified inbox which means all of your mails will be united into a single mailbox how this is going to work let me show you i'm so glad you asked let's wait for the whole mails to load up okay for example I am going to now go to settings just right there here we go now click on add account if you have other gmail account you can put in that and in my case I am using an others email service provider which is Microsoft Outlook now I'm gonna enter my mail so just gonna keep it private okay once you have signed in your Outlook account this will automatically check for servers fetch folders and do the process you can do some specific things but i'm going with the default ones not going to change anything at all yep the frequency should be never because i want manual checking and not the automatic sync now as you can see we have an other mailbox called the unified inbox in unified inbox you get both of your gmail as well as microsoft outlook emails okay now need to show you that now you can see I get both of my emails in one app without having to juggle between two different apps or two different web mails I simply need can go to my Mozilla and just refresh it and all of my mails from Gmail and Outlook will be there if you have other email addresses like Yahoo or iCloud.com you can use them as well so no need to check for settings and 
yep that's how we are going to use it let me just see what I can do yep that's just perfect so anyway that's been it thanks for watching and I will catch you guys in the next one take care bye bye